Do not attempt to adjust your set. This is a streaming freedom video bulletin. It cannot be stopped, and it is the only free voice left on the net. Hello friends, and welcome back to the channel. For today's video, we are in Shenmue 3. I want to show you how you can easily make money once you have reached Nyawu. Now I do want to state that I am not the originator of this method. This method has been shown before. I simply want to show that it still works. Also, if this is your first time to Nyawu, without giving away any spoilers, you will have to progress a little bit in the story, not by much, but a little bit, to unlock the areas that we will be visiting for the particular shops that we need in order to do this method. It is recommended to have at least 900 yuan before attempting this method. What we will be doing is visiting three different Buddha shops and at these shops buying specific statues. The statues we will then be trading for a move scroll and then turning around and selling the move scroll back. Now something to keep in mind is that each time you do this you will lose a little bit in the exchange. It is not much but there will be a little bit of a loss. However, by using this method, you will easily be able to make a ton of money in Nyawu. So with all of that said, let's get into the video. So using Hotel Nyawu as a starting point, you want to make your way to the promenade. There are three different shops that we will be visiting. The first one of which you can find located here, the Golden Buddha. There is one particular statue that we want from this shop and we will be buying many copies of it. Now this is important, however many copies of this first statue you buy is the same amount you want to buy of all corresponding statues at the other shops. That is because as the set we will be exchanging it for the move scroll that we will then be turning around and selling back. And again, each time you do this you will lose a little bit in the exchange. If you have around 600 to 900 yuan, I would suggest probably no more than 5 statues at first. I originally bought 10 as I am doing here, and I found that I did run out of money near the end of the statue buying. Also, at the end of this video you will notice I actually have 100 statues plus the 10 that I am buying in the video. That is simply because I have done this many times and I didn't want to make you have to sit through me buying 100 statues. So I actually will be selling 110, but for the purposes of this video I will be buying 10 statues from each shop. Here is the next shop we will be visiting, the Bargain Buddha. At this shop we will be purchasing 3 different statues and again 10 of each for the purposes of this video, or however many that you purchased of the original statue. The first statue is this one, the ceramic arhat sitting, and make certain that there is a number 2 at the end of it. The next statue is this one, copper statue of a military officer. And the final statue at this shop is the wooden targata statue sitting. Once you have made all the required purchases from this shop, we will be heading to one final Buddha shop which you can find by heading in this direction. The shop is located here. The name of it is Buddha Heaven. There is two separate statues that we need from this in order to finish the set. The first statue is called the Gold Wise Man Standing. And the next and final statue is located right next to it, the Gold Hermit Standing. With this purchase, the collection is now complete and we are now going to take the statues that we have purchased and exchange them for a particular move scroll from the nearby pawn shop which you can find by heading in this location. Other pawn shops may also contain the same move scroll but this is the one that I use and recommend for this cash first pawn shop. 
from this pawn shop, there is a particular move scroll that we are looking for, which is called Tiger Thigh. So speak with the shopkeeper and choose the exchange option. On the screen, scroll down to other sets, then hit R1. Here you'll see the statues that we had purchased. There is a complete collection, and again, as you see, I actually have 110 because I had purchased 100 before. Now you want to exchange these sets, however many it was that you purchased, for the Tiger Thigh. I am going to go ahead and fast forward, but not cut the footage here, just so that you can see I am exchanging all of these. Also, one thing to note is, while you can exchange all the statues in your collection for the scrolls, when it comes to selling the scrolls, you will have to keep one. You can sell all duplicates, but the game will force you to keep one of the scrolls that you have purchased. Now that I've exchanged the final set of statues that I had purchased, I have 110 skill books in my inventory. Speak with the shopkeeper again. However, this time, choose the sell option. Then on the following screen, select skill books. Here you'll notice it says I actually have 111 of Tiger Thigh. That is because I am unable to sell the final skill book but I am able to sell all 110 that I exchanged for the previously purchased statues. As you can see, my money is quickly going up, skyrocketing. This is a much better, much more efficient way to be able to make money in the game. You can still do the various jobs that the game has to offer, and I do suggest trying them at least once, it's just that you will not make a lot of money that way. However, by doing this, I am able to enjoy all the content that Shamu 3 has to offer, all the different and various arcade games, capsule toy machines, and such. Even the gambling without fear of losing too much money. You can do this as often as you like, as much as you need to. But as stated before earlier in the video, you will lose a little bit in the exchange each time you do. However, in my experience, it's really not that much to notice. Again, I do want to state that I am not the originator of this method, I simply want to show that it is still working as of the date of the recording of this video. I hope this will help you out if you've been having issue with making money in Shenmue 3. Thank you for taking the time to watch the video. Take care everybody. This has been a Streaming Freedom Video Bulletin. Peace out.